Hello ladies and gents, Ro here and welcome to Nonor Films. Today we're going to continue our iPhone tutorials and in the previous tutorial we covered the control center. From your home screen, if you swipe up, drag up, um, you'll, you'll, you'll be able to actually bring up the control center which can be brought up within any app. We covered the entire control center in the previous tutorials. Be sure to check it out. These are some of your main apps, some of your quick keys within the actual iPhone or uh, i. Pod, I believe it's available on iPod and then also like the flashlight for example. Now I'm going to drag swipe that back down and then this tutorial is going to cover how to rearrange apps and your hotbar at the bottom and uh, just basic how to categorize, categorize apps as well. So the way you go into this mode is by if you click on an app and just hold it, don't let go. All the apps will begin jiggling like this and you'll see X's at some of, um, uh, on some of them. And uh, for example, let me show you guys begin real quick. The hot bar is down here at the bottom, right here where I'm dragging this app around at the very bottom. That's This is the hot bar down here, the four apps. And uh, these four apps, no matter what screen you're on, they stay there, those four apps at the bottom. And this is, you might have more than four if you're like an I, on an iPad. But uh, you can adjust what apps you have up here by simply holding the app, one app down, and then you can drag that app and then put it down somewhere else, and then drag a different app in there. It's very basic, just hold and drag, hold and drag. It's just as simple as that. And at the moment, I have in my hotbar, I have my phone app, my messages, Clash of Clans, and settings. Those are probably the most apps I probably open up every day. So, so let me show you guys basics as again to go into the edit. Just hold down an app, it can be any app, and then you'll get the options for it. Now, you can rearrange these apps wherever you want, basically, by dragging it into that location or dragging it over an app, and it will give you the option to drop it inside that uh, make it a category of apps. For example, let's say you have a bunch of similar apps, like uh, for example, I have here at the very bottom. Now, to get rid of out of the editing mode before I actually begin <laughs> um, covering the categorizing. Um, let's say you're in editing mode and you can't get out of it. What you gotta do is just tap the home button and it will take you straight out of the editing mode. So uh, down here at the very bottom I have my extras. And if you notice I'm gonna open it up and uh, right here I have extras and within the extras I have iTunes Store, Calculator, Stocks, Compass. These are just apps, some of the apps that came with the actual iPhone and I probably don't want it. I'm not gonna be using them as much. So I put them all in the extras tab. That way they're not in my way. They're not taking up space. So the way you want to do this is, uh, let me just show you guys, for example, reminders here. I'm going to hold it down to go in edit mode, and then I want to drag it in my extras file. And you can just drag it and drop it, and since I already have, uh, how many, there's nine here already, so it's going to create another page within that app. So I'm going to exit out, take it out again. And it's just as simple as that, just drag and drop. If you want to take one out of your category, take it out and then drag it out. But then you can just go over it and drag it in. As you can see, I'm doing here. I'm just dragging and dropping. Now, to create a category is all you're going to have to do. For example, let's say I want to combine my Reminders and Notes app into the same app. Or no, even better, Reminders and Calendar, which are very similar. So I'm going to put it right over the Calendar app. And it's going to open it up. And then you can drag it up in here. Or, whoops, that didn't work out the way I wanted it to. Go in the Calendar, drag it in. Now I have the two apps within one category and it's named, it gives you the default name of productivity and I'm going to name it actually, delete that and I'm going to name it calendar, calendar, which I spelled wrong. So there we go and then you can tap out of outside of the box, like you're in this box, you can tap outside of the box to actually go out of the category. Now hit the home button to exit out of the edit mode and you'll be able to see now I have a calendar category which has calendar and reminders within it. And that, that's the basic of categorizing. Be sure to leave any questions or comments in the comment section below. And as you can see here, I just now you can get rid of this category as well by dragging the app out of the category. It'll automatically delete that category since there's no apps in there and then it'll take you back to where you were originally. But like I said, leave any comments or questions in the comment section below. I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Thank you guys for watching. Catch you guys next tutorial and later.